Hello everyone, my name is Papa, and welcome to a game that I've only has been described to me as an acid trip. It's called What Remains of Edith Finch. Now, if I pronounce that horribly wrong, I couldn't pronounce it in the first place. I literally had to get a friend to help. <laughs> so, you know, it's a great day. Anyways, it seems like a good game. Um, the only time I've any, seen anyone play this game was uh, Rambu. I don't know if you know the streamer. Pretty <laughs> Some nobody. Anyways, <laughs> that was a joke. Please, that was a joke. I don't need to get, like, crucified, all right? And so I thought it'd be interesting to play on recording to get my first reactions. Like I said, I don't know anything about this game other than it has been described to me as an acid trip and that Rambu played it. So, you know, quite an interesting. Um, and also, I fucking, I, I don't know if this is going to go to a title scene or what, but if this, like, goes straight to the game, bro, I hate games that do that. Cool house. <laughs> That's so loud. Oh my god. Ow. Fuck, man. What? What? Huh? Huh? Alright, holy shit. Sorry, man. Fuck, okay. What remains of either Finch? We're on a boat. Oh. Shit. Um, okay. Got it. A lot of this isn't going to make sense to you, and I'm sorry about that. I'm just going to start at the beginning with the house. I'm going to start at the beginning with the house. Okay, never mind. They what? 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 Huh? We're leaving. Someone had put up a chain link fence but it looked like I wasn't the first person to hop it. <gasps> oh, All right. My brother Milton disappeared when I was four. It was like the house just swallowed him up. Milton Finch, missing. If you have information about Milton, call the... I can't read that word. It's so blurry. Island police deputy or de dept deep dep, which is don't call that. It probably doesn't. Oh, eh. interesting. I wonder if you did call it. I don't have a phone right now. Mine broke. The date uh, date missing. <laughs> well, hello there. Um, October twenty third, two thousand and six. Date of birth nineteen ninety two. On the fifth of the nineteenth. So that'd be, I don't know. I, I really don't know right now. Uh, height for, you're a short ass. You deserve to go missing. Oh, bro, this reminds me of like those like really pretty gardens that some people have. I lived here until I was 11, but I wasn't allowed inside half the rooms. Ooh, weed. No, okay. What is... Inside the mailbox were bills from seven years ago, marked urgent, open immediately. Final note. Jesus Christ. Oh, we have a person. Better than most games. I'm just usually invisible. Back since my brother Lewis's funeral. Jump. Hop the fence. Oh, or push it, whatever. Wait, Lewis? Lewis's funeral? Inner will. My mother left me a key, but didn't tell me what it unlocked. First off, this is pretty. Can we just appreciate this for a second? This is genuinely pretty. This game is genuinely pretty. Holy shit. Oh my god. Fucking gorgeous. I know it's supposed to get acid trippy later, but it's actually gorgeous. Fucking hell. Maybe she thought I'd know. Or she thought the mystery would be enough to bring you back. Which way do I go? It's gonna be like, no, not that way, dumbass. But I wanna take the scenic route. I'm done with the scenic route. I'm okay, we're going back. I'm gonna take it. But if I get jumped. Please don't jump me, I have a key. 
Even after I inherited the house, I never thought I'd come back to it. Why? But now I had questions about my family that only the house knew the answers to. Oh? Bro, this game. The woods around the house have always been uncomfortably silent. Uh huh. Like they're about to say something, but never do. On God? Preach? What the fuck? That was so unnerving, but like really pretty to walk through. It was like a mix. Just on my walking arc. Ooh, let's shoot some hoops. Yeah, fuck our family. They're dead anyways. Let's shoot some basketball hoops. Oh, bro, this is a... That was an old truck. I know you can't see it well. But that motherfucker old, old. The house was exactly like I remembered it. The way it... I've been dreaming about it. Who? I'm sorry. Can we have a talk about that for a second? Can we have a fucking talk about that for a second? Why do video games with like mysterious houses just have to make them the most unstructurably sound shit I have ever seen? You got Hello Neighbor. You got this fucking game. You got the you know, the Finches. You know, the Finches. Weird last name. You got like you know multiple different games with like houses. Okay, well those are the only two I can think of at the top of my head that just make them unstructurably sound as fuck. Those support beams aren't going to help you when someone starts doing TikTok dances at 3 in the morning. You know, fucking from the top and then everything dropped. The whole house came crumbling down. Like, fucking hell. Learn how to do architect. Learn how to build houses, asshole. It's not hard. It's the brother again. As a child, the house made me uncomfortable in a way I couldn't put into words. Well, no shit. Actually, it's kind of pretty. Other than that. All right. You didn't see what happened. A little bit of a technical difficulty there for a second. Had a fucking meltdown. But no, I'd be uncomfortable because of that. I would sneeze and the whole thing would come crumbling down. There's so many missing posters. Jesus Christ. The same kid. He's four, six. Now, as a 17 year old, I knew exactly what those words were. I was afraid of the house. So all logic and reason is telling me to get out of here. There's no need to continue this adventure because if there's something we don't want to do, we don't do it. Let's go get some Wendy's. <laughs> this video is not sponsored by Wendy's. <laughs> all right, let's go into the house. Oh, pretty necklace. Let's go into the house. The fucking haunted house. I swear to God, if this door opens. I'm uncomfortable. Oh, it's a little finch. It's a little finch. Or it's probably not, and I'm just a dumbass. Mmm, yes. Mmm, handicap ramp. Mmm, yes. We. It's actually kind of kind of fast. Can I sit? Wait. Let me. I want to like. I want to like sit. No sitting. Damn. We have to be terrified, and we can't rest our feet. The fuck, man. We can still turn back. It's still an option? No, okay. I hope the key might unlock the front door. It didn't. Oh. I swear to God, if something pops out of it. Looking in, I felt like the house itself had been waiting for me. I swear to God, if something like jumps at me. Well, like, I look through this, and I've played, oh, fucking hell, dude, I've played too many horror games in my life, and watched too many, like, horror, you know, videos, because I, like, opened it, and looked in, and my first thought went, some asshole, with, like, no, like, their intestines hanging out, is gonna, like, start running at the door. Fuck me, man. That, that had me have a moment. Alright, let's close this bitch. No needed. So, how the fuck do we get in? We have a second chance to leave. Let's go, Wendy's, ri <laughs> Wendy's trip. Let's go. <laughs> oh, go get some fucking Taco Bell. Go get some like McDonald's. Don't do this. Kick in the garage window. <laughs> the basement window. It's not the garage window. Wait, does the house go? Oh, it's wind chimes. I was like, is there a fucking jukebox playing? Don't tell me this is how I'm about to enter. 
I hate this. Crawling through the doggy door used to be a lot easier when I was 11. Oh my god, this is how we get possessed. This is it, boys. The Possession. Been turned off the night we left. Sweet mother of Jesus. I've seen too many horror movies for this shit. Bro, at this point, I'd be out of here. What the fuck? I would walk into the doggy door. I wouldn't even go in the doggy door. I would see the structural, like, f like how the house is built and go, oh, hell no, and walk away. Any house that is not structurally sound needs you to just leave. Is there like a flashlight in here? First time in years. I felt like I was home. <laughs> Fuck you. All right, they're just gonna have to pray on everything that like my controller doesn't die because I'm pretty sure I don't have a battery. Can I like smack a book on this thing and break it? It's looking into my soul. Jesus Christ. Family, they were just memories of one. <sighs> Lewis Finch. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Like how after Lewis started working at the cannery, we all got sick of eating salmon. Except That's so true. Molly. Oh my God, we love Molly. Wait a minute. Pause. Hold on. Not that kind. The cat. <laughs> oh, it's a recipe. The recipe was haunted. Good to know. Don't make it. You'll die. I swear to God, if I like, I feel so uncomfortable. I'm going to like turn the corner and... Oh, okay. It's... The table was still a wreck from the night we left. It was like a bomb had gone off, killing everyone but sparing the furniture. So it wasn't wine. Good to know. I know I'm like so intrigued by everything. Jesus Christ. It's a lady. My mom was the only one of us who could imagine Great Grandma Edie living in a nursing home. Great grandma, are you? Did you? Your, did your whole family live in one fucking house, bro? That's how serial killers are born. Jesus Christ! Like all the way from your ancestors and everything, same house. Jesus Nothing fucking in Christ! House looked abnormal. There was just too much of it, like a smile with too many teeth. You're right, bro. There's so many books. The fuck you mean abnormal? Who reads this much? My siblings and me when it comes to certain genres. That's who. Even the fireplace had a story. Oh. Edie told me the bricks came from the original house after it sank. Oh, this house is built on a dead house? It's a little quirky of it. Do the words go? Don't. Thank you. I think I've made myself pretty fucking clear. <laughs> All right. Cute birds, a radio, a door I'm not going down because that's how you die. A random box that I'm opening to get possessed. No, no. Great Grandpa Sven built a music box for Barbara, along with the rest of the house. Why is there Bigfoot? I... I'm suddenly very uncomfortable. Thank you. Fuck me, dude. Oh my god. Mom always told me to stay out of the basement, so I wasn't too surprised when the key didn't fit. Just kick down the door. Oh wait, the whole house might fall. Never mind. I was gonna be like, yo, FBI, open up that bit. See, here's the thing about this. This is why I feel so uneasy. Is because not things don't look unnormal. They don't look uneasy. They just look a lot of things wrong. Behind in the whirlwind of that last night. Like packing peanuts. God, what a tragedy. Another missing poster. My mom poster. wasn't much of an optimist, but she never stopped believing that my brother Milton was alive. Milton's dead. Get over it. Oh shit! We got a ride. No. Okay. Why? Here, I'll kick it in. Hiya! Kick 
kicking it in did not do little jack shit. This is how I die, this is how I die, this is how I die. Mom sealed up all the bedrooms. Then Edie retaliated and drilled peepholes. There's so many pictures. Bro. It's like the house. Okay, okay. This is, I, I need to explain why I don't feel like, like I feel so uneasy. Because they do it really well. And I don't know if it's on purpose or not. Maybe I'm just like a fucking frantic mess. It's, it's not because of, like, it, it doesn't feel like it's, um, wrong, right? It feels like a normal house, except for the structural sound. It's like, it's like she said, it's like a smile with too many teeth. It's, it's, there's so much. It's so crowded, dark, musty, and old, and it just feels wrong. It feels like anywhere I step can collapse, or, you know, I'm gonna get fucking jumped at any corner. Like, this painting needs to die right now, right? It, it feels uneasy, like the amount of books, the random trap door, the pictures of the old men, doors completely sealed. That cannot be open. I can unplug this. I will do it. What if I do? You know, wine cabinets out where children can get them. So many books, like that book room that was under there, right? Like, what the fuck? It just feels uneasy. Whenever people ask me about my family, the first thing they always want to know about is Barbara. Barbara was famous. Good to know. Barbara, you're a bitch. Edie's father, Odin, built the original house. Also, those noises, I know it, it, like, it sounds like a door opens, which we know it's not. Oh, hell no! There's dead bugs on the wall, and you're telling me I'm supposed to go in there? Bro, that's a shark! That's how I die! Oh, it's gonna, it's gonna, it's either that or the mysterious trap door on the ceiling. I'm taking my chances with the trap door. Bum ba bum 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 bum. I'd rather die from the trap from something falling on me than getting Mom, possessed. Third floor stairs on the night we left. God, fucking, dang it! I'm gonna have to go in that room, and I don't want to. I don't want to. Shit, God, why I have to be a fucking stereotypical white guy? Spent a lot of time playing in Great Uncle Walter's room. Oh. I think my mom sometimes regretted not sealing it up. Okay, we weren't possessed, and the stereotype was, you know, white people in movies had a moment. Lewis told me there were secret passages, but I never believed him. Open it. It's not gonna work. Turns out my mom was really good at keeping secrets. Sweet mother of God, what was your mom, James Bond? Now it was time to find out what my mom had been afraid of. Yo, your mother's an FBI agent. I'm telling you now. From the paintings on the wall, it was clear my brother Milton had been here before me. Cool. Hey, Milton. Cool, 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 cool. Getting Maybe possessed, it's, poggers. Maybe it sounds like I had a plan. You didn't. Plot twist. Plans are for losers. It's a kid's room. God, I hate children. Just like I had no idea where all this was going to lead. Where was this going to lead? That necklace is possessed. I Every up looking at Molly's room through the peephole. Everything is possessed. Wait, wait, wait. Did did the mother lock their children in their rooms and seal them up? Hey, yo, fuck her. She wasn't an FBI agent. She was a serial killer. That's the only excuse I have for her. She's actually a fucking psychopath. For the first time, I felt like I'd stepped behind a painting. Through the brick wall. <laughs> Mario, Mario 64, that bitch. Through the paintings, like she was saying. Yeah, this seems like a stereotypical, like, you know, little kid's room. Mom. Don't do drugs. 
please don't be like a dead body. Gerbil had a tiny bedroom with its own even tinier gerbil cage. That's the cutest shit I've ever seen. Man, now I want a gerbil. I'm kidding. I've got to go like pet my rabbit after this. I have a rabbit. I don't know if I've ever made that very clear. Hi, Molly. I got the sense Edy had spent a lot of time here before my mom sealed the doors. Wait, so that wait, did she seal the door before the before she died or after she died? Molly from 1937 to 1947. It's like Okay, I know math. No, I don't. I don't care enough to do math though. I told you Molly was possessed. I'm, I'm like, everything is possessed, goddammit. Nothing is real. I'm gonna get haunted by every motherfucker. Alright, probably after her story, or well, like, I don't know. I don't know. After this story, where, where, where do we go? Where do we even go? Holy shit. Ah, I don't want this episode to be like four hours long, but it might be. Who fucking knows? My editing process is gonna be lovely. Is that a fucking feather? 1947. Oh. Dear Diary. I'll be gone soon, but I wanted to tell somebody about what's going to happen. It started when Mom sent me to bed without dinner. Wh what? I woke up and I was starving, so I looked around for something to eat. You'll be gone. Did, is this the child's, like, self game end note? Ah! Oh, it's a leaf. It's just a leaf. I'll eat the pumpkin. The fuck is in front of me? My Halloween candy was all gone. Shit! That your fucking mother ate it. Kill her. I said we kill her. Kill her and eat her, actually. Please don't tell me I'm gonna have to eat the goldfish. I can't reach the goddamn sink. Help. I kept eating and eating. Can you eat tooth? That's horrible. For, don't eat toothpaste. That's... Ugh. Do not eat toothpaste, please. Jesus Christ. I ate. I ate a lot of things that night. Those are fake, aren't they? Or are those actually real? Then I heard chirping outside my window. Wait, I'm more curious about this motherfucker. The gerbil food was dry, but I didn't mind it. Oh, God. I'm leaving. Mom, can I come out now? Sweetheart, it's late. Go to sleep. Fuck you. I'm leaving. One with the bird, boys. One with the bird. Was a barn swallow going back to her nest. Oh, how cute. Are we gonna eat the bird? Am I gonna make this conscious decision? You want you wanna be eaten? What's that? You do you wanna be eaten? He nodded. I reached out for her. And suddenly what in the fuck? I was a cat. What, what the hell? I tried to be quiet, but the bird was really scared. Yoink. I'm so confused. How much? Okay, Molly, listen. I know the name was Molly. But were we on, Molly? Mom and Dad didn't even look at me. Die! Yunk. Where can I go? I can go on that perch. Right. Go. Go. <laughs> Get your ass! Oh, damn. Heh. <laughs> Shit. I'm so confused. What happened? I jumped and I almost 
just got her. I jumped and I almost did more Molly that night. I could tell she was getting really tired. Yeah. And now I was up in the big tree. Get them when they're weak. I wouldn't climb it anymore. All I cared about was eating that mama bird. Get them when they're weak. Yeah. I gobbled her up. And suddenly. And died? I was an owl. What in the fuck? First, all I heard was the wind. Then I heard little teeth nibbling in the grass. Little teeth? What in the hell? I don't... I'm so confused. Little teeth nibbling. Am I supposed to be like looking? Oh no. My game is lagging. Oh no. Oh, sweet. Mother of God, that's just poor hygiene. That's just poor taste in, like, existence. Not chewing? Fuck, man, do it. I can't look up. That's... I'm gonna go pet mine and that rabbit after this. Fuck this. Get in your ass. I feel awful. Uh, oh, oh. oh my god. <laughs> Ow! Shit! Fuck! Shit! Ow! Oh, damn! Oh! Oh! My sternum! Oh! Oh! Subtle bitch! Oh! Fuck! Me! Uh oh! I rolled off a cliff and into the ocean. I almost got hit by a car. Now I was hungrier than ever. Don't do drugs, kids. Can I go down? Oh, I can. I was like so confused for a second. I wanted fat, juicy seals. Not the seal. Oh no! Oh god. Where the fuck did she go? I ain't never been evaded like that before. Fucking hell. Okay, there she is. I'm gonna eat you. Nom nom time. Oh! When I opened my eyes, everything had changed. Oh! The fuck is this? What are these noises? These noises are disgusting. What, what the hell has happened? What the fuck? <laughs> that is not okay. What? Am I like eating? Now I was a monster and I smelled people everywhere. Ew, ew, oh my god. This just feels wrong. This is so bad that my whole computer, like, I'm just lagging really badly. That's how bad this is. Oh, I'm not gonna use Did I just resort to cannibalism? Hoggers. So. I wanted to stop, but also I didn't. The drunken sailor, what? Get 
you're not safe. Oh, shit, my bad. Oh, but Ah, the music, it hurts. It's genuinely too loud. Hey, your music! Quit it! Okay. What the fuck? This is why we don't eat cheese before bed, kids. Where the fuck? I got closer and closer. Um. Um. Pardon? All my stomach started growling. And suddenly, I was me again. I held my breath for a long time, but I couldn't hear anything. I think it's waiting for me to fall asleep. But it's not going to wait much longer. It needs to be, and we both know I will be delicious. I'm not sure if I believed all of that, but I'm sure Edie would have. What the f- Don't you meow at me! And that's gonna do it for this first episode. Um... Do we end it off with cannibalism? Is that just like an acceptable thing we're gonna end it with? Like, are we just gonna straight up end it with cannibalism? Yeah, we are. Anyways, if you guys want to see more of this, which there probably will be, even if you don't want to, because now I'm more intrigued than ever, um, make sure to smash that like button and or subscribe. Um, you know, it's a weird game. I the, the acid trippy part was completely right. And um, yeah, honestly, it's a pretty good game so far. Uh, little little horrorish, little Jesus Christ. I don't know how to feel. I just, I genuinely don't. Like, that is... That is such a weird... St so, wait, is she telling... I is can't describe it, but I felt like some part of Molly was still here. Don't look under the bed. You might die. Okay, no, I'm, I'm, I'm done. I'm done. I'm ending the episode there. I want to keep playing, so I'm going to edit the video. And we might get, maybe, maybe, if I'm feeling up to it, double upload day. That might be fun. Uh, don't, don't put my word to that. All right. Don't, don't be like, yes, double upload, do a puppet now. Um, so yeah, with that being said. Anyways, if you enjoyed, make sure to smash that like button. You know, like I was saying, do all that whole subscribing shit. I'll probably post another episode very soon. <laughs> Um, this game is fucking dope. I feel uncomfortable. Alright, see y'all next time. Do not die. Peace. <laughs>